everyone, it's Annie from Tackle Share. I'm at the OFAH Heritage Center. Behind me is the Ontario Record Fish Wall. This wall showcases the largest legally caught fish in Ontario. Behind me is the bowfin. So today we're going to learn all about the bowfin. All of the information in this video can be found online at tackleshare.com resources. We've uploaded a bowfin fish fact sheet for free to download if you want to refer back to all the details that I'm going to cover in this video. On the Ontario Record Fish Wall, the bowfin, also known as dogfish, mudfish, grindle, and mud pike, is located over here on the warm water fish section of the Record Fish Wall. This is a replica of the largest legally caught bowfin, which is 15.10 pounds. Bowfins have a long cylindrical body they have one long dorsal fin that spans almost the full length of their body. When identifying between male and female, look at their tail. Males have a dark spot that is twice as big as their eye. Bowfin also have many small pointed teeth. The burbot has similar features to bowfin, however, burbot have two dorsal fins, a short one followed by a long one, and a long anal fin, as long as their dorsal fin, and they also have a barbel on their chin which bowfin do not. The invasive northern snakehead is another similar species that can be differentiated from bowfin by its long anal fin, and it does not have a dark spot on its tail. To learn more about the northern snakehead and other Ontario invasive species, go to invadingspecies.com. The bowfin also has a bony plate on the underside of its jaw called a guller plate. Neither the burbot nor the northern snakehead have a bony plate on their heads. Bowfin are mostly found in the Great Lakes, St. Lawrence River, Lake Nipissing, Lake Simcoe, and Lake of the Woods. They prefer warm, swampy water that is low moving or still with lots of vegetation. Their air bladder allows them to live in stagnant areas that are uninhabitable for other game fish. Bowfin spawn in May to June when the water temperature reaches 16 to 19 degrees Celsius. They will build nests in water that is one to two feet deep in areas with vegetation, stumps, logs, and bushes. Males will guard young in schools to protect them from predators. When the young reach about two inches in length, they develop adult coloration and they start to protect themselves. They depart completely from the school at around four inches in length. A female that is 21 inches long can lay around 64,000 eggs. They often lie still waiting to ambush prey as opportunistic and greedy eaters. Their diet includes a wide variety of things including other small game fish, minnows, crayfish, vegetation, and frogs. Bowfin live for an average of 12 years and can grow 18 to 24 inches long. Most bowfin are caught unintentionally although they are aggressive fighters which makes them a good target for anglers of all skill levels. When fishing for bowfin, use a Carolina or Texas rig with soft baits. A weedless topwater lure like a frog would also work well in heavy weed cover and in lily pads. Bass anglers are likely to catch bowfin as bass are found in similar areas and are susceptible to bass lures. Thank you for watching and if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to learn more about Ontario fish, uh, subscribe to our channel and tap the notification bell so that you'll be notified when we post more All About Fish videos. As you can see, this is a large Ontario record fish wall, so we have many more videos to come.